Hey guys, KKG, and welcome to Young and Proud Educators. We're continuing with Teachers' Diaries, Online Teaching Diaries. So, today went well. It was our, um, what, our third day, day three, and, and we're taking a day at a time. Not, we're not just wanting to do everything at once. We're not wanting to just experience everything at once. We're just taking a day at a time. If it's, if it's a good day, we celebrate it. If it's a bad day, um, we reflect and we learn from it. Just like that. Remember, Baba Iti Mother Rome was not built in one day. It was not built in one day. Same as online teaching. We cannot just do it in one day and we excel. We expect it to be different. And it's quite different. As I mentioned in my previous one, uh, my previous reflection that, you know what, it's quite different. We need that human touch. We, as a people, we, we excel in um, human interactions and uh, physical touch, handshake, fist pump. We miss those things. But yeah, just today, guys, just a quick reflection um, at my school. I'm so grateful that I'm working at that school. I'm grateful that I have um, innovative leaders, innovative leaders. So we go back and we teach online on campus. And and as such, once you finish with your lessons, then you, you can go home and, and maybe continue with your um, admin work if you like. If not, then you can continue with your admin work. But once you finish teaching, your online teaching, your live teaching, once you finish um, talking to your students, teaching them, then you're allowed to go. Which I thought it's a brilliant thing ever, you know. Um, and, and I think in, in, in the near future, that's where the world is going to. In fact, it's not, not in the near future. It's happening already. If you look at 2000, those young guys born just now, now in 2000, those are the guys that don't want to be, um, to be in that space, that one office space, confined in that space that you can only do work here. They want to work from, from far. And most of them, they do freelance because they don't want to go to... To, to that company and that, but now I'm here to work and, and do work and be in that office. Now they want to be in a space where it allows for creativity, it allows for for them to just be themselves and, and work as much as they, they they can or be as creative as as they, they can be. So from today's experience like it, it taught me a lot that you know what we 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 will go to the world where where we can teach our kids from anywhere. Um, they, they don't need to come to class. We, we, we're not trading. We're not trading our um, time for, for money. But as long as you can deliver, that's where we, we're going to move to. Or that's where we're already moving into. But was glad it's looking like it's coming into um, the space, the education sector which is really not, not, not as flexible as I think it should be um, compared to other economic sectors. Because once we have something that, that has anything to do with um, internet and it's in the economic sector, we'll see that quick change. But in education, it takes a while to be implemented. It takes a while to, to start kicking in. But hey, thanks to COVID, we now see those changes being implemented and for such, we, I don't know, we grateful, we excited, we whatever, I don't know. But yeah, it's good to see changes happening, it's good to see the good happening, it's, it's good to have that freedom. So you know what, I can come in this time and do the work and then complete my admin at home. Or I can just complete here or work from wherever. So that's boss. Okay guys, I will catch you tomorrow. Um, my reflection for fourth day of online teaching and if you guys you had it bad today don't worry take it easy one day at a time continue teaching tomorrow continue teaching tomorrow and and you're gonna get it up just make sure that you ask you ask you learn you implement ask learn implement ask learn implement and that's it peace to you that we can teach us, we see you, we know you, and we appreciate what you are doing for us, for the world.